If you watch my videos, I'm willing to bet that you've heard of a show called The Exiles. On the off chance that you somehow haven't, the story is basically that two FBI agents are tasked with investigating all different kinds of paranormal occurrences. Now it's no doubt an entertaining series, while well, I'm certain there are things out there beyond our understanding, I wouldn't have a channel if there weren't, does the FBI really go around investigating them? The answer might surprise you. The documents referred to in this video were released under the Freedom of Information Act, and I'll drop a link to it in the description below. The year was 1976. Peter Byrne, the director of the Bigfoot Information Center and Exhibition, sent the FBI 15 hairs attached to a piece of skin. Byrne didn't know what animal the hairs came from and wanted the FBI to do a DNA analysis, believing that they may belong to a Bigfoot. The FBI wrote back that although this would be outside of their usual responsibilities, they were willing to make an exception, as the answer would be, in the interest of research and scientific inquiry, and asked him to submit it to the FBI laboratory, along with whatever background information he had available. Byrne wrote another letter, this time to the aforementioned laboratory, requesting they analyze the specimen and outlining what his organization stood for insisting that they are serious in their mission, along with several news articles on Bigfoot. The FBI replied that they had received several similar reports following the publishing of the 1975 Environmental Atlas, which mentioned Bigfoot and claimed that the FBI analyzed potential Sasquatch hair and said that it matched no known animal. The agent Byrne was in contact with told him they had no record of this, but approved a recommendation to grant his request. The request was ultimately granted, and the hairs were tested against other animals to see if they could find any matches. Now, I hate to break the hearts of all my fellow true believers, but they were able to find a match, with their analysis determining the hair to be a deer's. Since then, no FBI agents have investigated the American Ape Man, or at least if they have, this investigation has never made the light of day. But here's hoping that one day, we'll be able to end the world's longest manhunt.